A bleak outlook tonight for housing values in Oakland County. Analysts expect that by 2013, property in Oakland County will be worth half as much as it was in 2007. Action News reporter Glenda Lewis has the story from Troy. We've had a few calls, but no showings. John King's only been trying to sell his house for a month, but it's sitting between two other homes that have been on the market a lot longer, and he's already asking $30,000 below what he owes. I think there's harder times coming, and as far as the uh, housing market. <laughs> The figures were laid out as facts at the Oakland County Commissioner's meeting where County Executive L. Brooks Patterson presented a balanced three-year budget in a housing market that remains unbalanced. We recognize that home values will continue to decline probably through 2012. And um, if we look at the numbers between 2007 and 2012, beginning of 2013, 54% loss of the value of our homes. And with foreclosure rates also expected to reach an all-time high this year, that adds up to major money homeowners and the county is missing. So we're talking 15 years where our property tax revenues for um, county government, city government, schools aren't going to come back. What really needs to come back? Jobs. Brooks says work is the real foundation for the county's housing market. The real estate market's going to follow that by a couple of years. So we're still, we're not out of the woods, but well, I think we can see the, the light at the end of the tunnel. Glenda Lewis reporting, and we certainly hope we're seeing light. The state